Ladies and gentlemen, it's that time of the week once again. Time for your weekly update reminder video. Now, this isn't your weekly update. That video will be coming tomorrow a day early so you can prepare for it. But a reminder of all the things you have the rest of today and tomorrow to purchase that's on sale businesses that are on sale, and bonuses that you're able to get. So let's jump into it. And I know what you're thinking. There's no bloody businesses on sale this week, is there? Well, technically, no, there's no businesses, but there is the 50-car garage. So if you don't have the 50-car garage, it is currently on sale. It's typically 2.7 million just over, and it's on sale for 30% off for just under 2 million at 1.9 million. So if you are in the market for a 50-car garage, which seems to be going on sale quite a lot recently, um, now's your time to buy it. So go ahead and pick it up. And there's absolutely nothing to do with the arcade that I'm standing in. I don't know why I'm in. No, I do know why I'm in here. The auto shop is still broken. So last week I did a video telling you guys that it was broken and I thought I had a fix, which was doing the setup missions again. And then obviously as the day progressed, I learned that everyone had the issue. And even after doing the setup mission, it comes back. And then the next day, I did another video because supposedly Rockstar had done a, a back-end fix for it. They reverted it to an older one. And that didn't work either because my auto shop is still broken. And I still um, need to go back and set it up again. So I've just kind of... I'm ignoring the auto shop this week, which does suck because it is two times GTA money and RP on a few auto shop things. Not the contracts, unfortunately. You can't be doing the union depository. That was last week. But client jobs, so with the cars, you can get two times pay for those. And also the exotic exports. And I did do a video on it last week. So if you want to check that out and see if it's worth it, there's a video on the channel. Spoiler, I didn't think it was worth it. And then we have three times pay this week, ladies and gentlemen, on Simeon's contract missions, which are great. The repo work, which are great. And the exotic exports for Simeon, which are great. And when I say great, listen, you'll get like 60k for each one of Simeon's. You can only do one every real day. So if you're just starting today, you've only got today and tomorrow to be able to do it. But you'll get 60k around for each car. I'll throw them up on screen right here so you can see them. If you just grab one of these today and then another one tomorrow, not only will you get the 60k for dropping them off, but you will get a $100,000 bonus. And that's only for this week. You have to do two of the Simeon Export vehicles and you'll get an additional 100k. So just grab one of these cars, take it down to the docks, and um, you should... Yeah, well, you got to respray it first. Grab one of these cars, respray it, then take it down to the docks. You'll see the S for Simeon, and you'll make an extra 100K if you do two of them. But also, I made this video this week. If you are somebody that's newer to the game, if you do these Simeon repo work jobs that I showed you in this video, you will make a ton of XP. So if you want to make XP as a lower level player, and the peyote plants aren't with us anymore, so you can't do that right now, this is an easy way to do it. And then really quick, if you are a penny pincher and you do worry about money, um, the gun van discounts this week. There is 35% off for GTA Plus members for the heavy rifle and then 30% off for everyone for the unholy hellbringer. So if you're trying to save just a little bit more money, the gun van has those two things. But anyway, that's it for discounts on businesses and on, uh, well, your two times and three times pay. That it was a pretty stinky week, not gonna lie. Last week, this week, the, this year started off pretty, uh, pfft. I just take that back. The Union Depository was good. We all love a good Union Depository heist. We, we know this. But anyway, let's jump into your sale vehicles this week because you only have the rest of today and tomorrow if you want to pick these up. Now, for this week, they are all removed vehicles. These are all vehicles that you can no longer purchase in game. And because of that, you cannot go into your phone and find any of them in here. You're not going to be able to come in your phone and find them because uh, they're all removed vehicles. You can't buy them through your phone. And they're all in the exact same place. So let's go ahead and head on over there. But before we head to that showroom, as always, let's go to Luxury Autos and see what's knocking about over there. All right, so here we are at Luxury Autos and I have no idea why it is always nighttime. I feel like when I do these videos, the weekly update reminders, it's always nighttime, but it doesn't matter because we're only having a little peek. So once again, I've said this in the weekly update video last week. They're getting too confident sticking this thing in here. But the Karen Vivanite, if you are in the market, these are full price, by the way. Um, and I have no idea. It's not even a good livery. Like, what are they doing? What are you putting this in here for? It's a great car. No one cares. But if you want it, come down here and pick it up. And there we have the beautiful F8 Tributo, a.k.a. the Turismo Amagio. Now, these are full price, so it's not point... You know, you don't get too excited. But if you want this livery, you can come down here and get it. 
But anyway, let's move on to our cars that are on sale. And luckily for you guys, if you're in the market, they're all in the same place. And that place is right here, ladies and gentlemen. Premium Deluxe Motorsports. We're not gonna, we're not here to see Simeon, but we are here to look at all of these. Now, like I say, every single one of these is a removed vehicle. So if you want them, now is your time to get them and they're on sale. So if you're one of those people that are like, I'm trying to collect all of the ones they took out of the game, you can get five of them right here and on sale. Starting off with the Coil Raiden right here. 962,000 if you're in the market. I actually really like this. I really like this livery here. So we have the Overflood of Morgan. 1.5 million. Uh, I'm not going to be picking it up, but it is... I, I do like it. Next up, the Nebula Turbo. And if you purchase these from down here, by the way, you will get all of these liveries that are on them. Uh, so 576,000 for that. The Bravado Valeria, again, a super cool looking car. I can't tell if this is based off of a Morgan or of a TVR. Someone can let me know in the comment section. Maybe neither of those, but that's just the vibe I get. Uh, but 486,000, not bad. And last but not least, the Infernus for 308,000. And this, I'm mind blown that they even removed it from the game. It's literally one of the OG cars. It's a bloody Infernus, man. I mean, why, like... Uh, how why did they remove and don't these drive around the streets on these some of the cars that you can pick up just from the street don't these drive around which ones drive around i'm pretty sure it's just this one does this one drive am i going crazy anyway if you want to pick any of these up on sale they're all down here for 30 percent off you know the rest of today and tomorrow to get them all right and next up we're here at ls Carmi. we have our prize right here which is the michelle michelle gt is that what it's called michelle gt so win this you got to place top three for three days in a row so did you get this? Not me. All right. And then we have these three vehicles down here. And like I say, this is a week for removed vehicles. I swear this is why Rockstar did it, just to create some sort of hype behind them. But all three of these are removed. We have the Issy Sport, the Ocelot Lynx, and the Shyster Deviant. All three are removed vehicles, but all three are full price. This thing, by the way, is absolutely gorgeous. So if you want to pick any of these up, and um, you can come on down here to pick them up but like i say they are not on sale but they are all removed vehicles that you can't typically buy all right let's move on and ladies and gentlemen i just think this car is beautiful man i love like i say the cobra in real life and um it, i'm not sure about the livery i kind of would prefer it in the blue but you know what? Let's spin it. I would like to get this one, and I never win any of these anymore. I never do, man. All right, let's go ahead and spin this wheel. Will we get it? Where's the car? Where's the car? Where's the... Okay, there's the car. My eyes are locked onto it. I don't think it's going to spin all the way around. We're not going to get the car. Don't get... What are you giving me? You know what? I say I'll take the chips, but I've got so many chips now. What am I going to do with them, man? Cash them out, I guess. All right, guys, and that is it for this week's GTA 5 Online weekly update. Um, like I say, if you're trying to grind some XP this week, if you're a lower level, make sure you're checking out the Simeon's repo contracts. Like I say, I have a video on it on my channel. Just check back from last week, and you'll be able to see how to do that. And then pick up those cars if you're in the market. I can't wait to see what this next one is going to be. We're all waiting for the new Clucking Bell raid. I'm not sure if it's coming tomorrow, but I'm guessing it's going to be this month some point. Uh, because we're not, we don't want to go into March, April. I don't, I, who knows at this point? We've we've seen what the missions are going to be. We've seen what they're called. We've seen all the Simeon, uh, not Simeon, sorry, the Clucking Bell information. But now we're actually waiting on it because a lot of you guys still are waiting for that freaking Hellbringer, Hell, the uh, Hellfire, Hellfire, Hellbringer, the the the, the Hellcat police car, basically. A lot of people are waiting for that, and that is coming with the new clucking bell raid so we will see but anyway let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below what do you think is coming starting tomorrow and uh did you enjoy this week anyway i hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day and i'll see you with the weekly update video tomorrow so make sure you subscribe with notifications on so you know when i post it anyway hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day and i'll see you there with a brand new video goodbye